Hello everyone, today we're gonna play a modification for a game named World Conqueror. Oh, no, what's the game name? We're, um, I don't know, I don't remember. <laughs> what do you want from me? Um, this is uh, a series made by, as I remember, by the guys who made World Conqueror. It's the same thing, but um, this is European... Uh, European War for Napoleon, but this is a version with World War One. I. I played this game for a little while, as you see, I have a little number of things I made, but we're gonna play the conquest. As you see, there is Lenin, the main thing, but we're gonna try to play the start of the war, this um, horrifying war war the second war the first world war there's also a modification for the f second world war but not today maybe today who knows who knows i don't know who i should play for at the first uh, moment when i downloaded i thought to play for italy but then i understood maybe for spain but then maybe for the Ot there's so much choices but i have an idea let's try to play for someone only a little bit further like let's say i don't know europe 1916 um no oh let's play in the communist revolution F let's play for the russian empire because one thing i want to try i want to defeat defeat the communists at the same moment i will need to defend against the germans and at the same moment, I will need to defend against the Austro-Hungarians. But there's one thing which is pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. It's America. Hey. They're like the best part of this game. America. But there's another thing. They have Spain on their side. But we have Portugal, so the the everything is the same now. They have Spain, we have Portugal, the same countries, don't be scared. But here, our first part, I got an idea already, what should I do? One of my main plans is to defend against the communists and try to stay in a more defensive position against the fascists, the bad guys. But yes, um, I forgot, wait a sec, I need to check because here everything is serious. If you lose, you lose, you die, you're nothing, and there's Lenin and there's Stalin. We see these two people at the same moment. How strange. Oh god damn it, that's not the right thing. Um, but okay, here is our one of our generals, and at the same moment, as you see, we must be helping our allies. First, I'm gonna send men to the front and check. Oh god, I forgot. Um... Yes, yes, I am pretty sure that I'm right. That for this car, there is that Br Br Brusilov, General Brusilov, Alexei, as I remember, but I don't remember. And here is another problem the communists. They are f pretty near. God damn it, the, G the Germans t took our port. That's also a problem. But also, there is another problem for us. It's definitely, definitely the problem that Swedes are on their side. And if they get the chance, they could make a landing in this great city of Turku. And not, not far from Helsinki. But our main uh, part now, main plan is to defend against the Axi, the central powers with the um, against also the communists damn it i forgot again so i have kornilov here he will be leading our army against budyanov as i remember that's budyanov i hope so i i don't want to feel stupid again uh yes i'm right that's budyanov i just um i just know them <laughs> face by face all of them so here we move the french are trying to make a assault Battle of Marne <laughs> at the same moment. The Germans, uh, with the help of General Schluckblucher, as I remember, he's just staying there back behind. But here, 
our battles continue. No, nothing. But maybe... God! No, 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 no. I pressed something bad. Okay, I wanted to do this. Switch on HD and switch off all the sound. Well, except sound. Yes, we started again. God. But I don't want to start making the video. Okay, it's not a problem. We'll continue this stuff. Okay, we'll put in Cornel of here. His main attack, but Dion of fighting happens, but no one cares. Okay, you must attack Tver. I've actually never seen that... Wait, as I remember, <laughs> there's a little bug in the game. If the maker of this mode, uh, mod will be at some... I don't know, that's a very small chance, but if you'll be watching, I want to tell you, there's a little... It's a little, little bug that... All the time that there's St. Pete, St. Petersburg, um, the city, it's always named Petrograd, even when there's no communists. So, but yes, that's not a big problem. I'm just telling, just in case. So here we continue. At the same moment as we were just right behind, I just accidentally pressed restart and not options. But here the battle continue. This is like, here must happen the Battle of Ypres, and it's very funny, but Netherlands are on the side of the Germans. I mean, central powers, but you get the idea. So here, the battle of, next to the city of Tver happens. Defeating one part of the Soviet's army it will lower the moral of the other. That's logic. God, I hate you. She took Vyazma. That's a very strange name for a city, but who cares? And this guy, a strange personality. Who is he? I'm interested in who is that guy. I'm interested what's going on in this game. They We killed... Oh my god, what's his name? Fruns? Fruns? Fruns. I, I don't know what that means. Maybe he's a German. A German soldier. That makes sense. A German soldier in the Russian army. Yes, I hope I will not get killed by the KGB at this moment, but okay. Oh, and one game downloaded, because while I'm making a video, I'm definitely downloading another game to make a video about that game, and our army is getting destroyed by the austria Hungarians. But everything is not as horrible as I predicted. We are doing not horrible. Yes, I want to make a tank. I want to collect money for it. It costs a lot. It it costs it costs like a fortune. But yes, I hope the French and the allies will continue to oppress the central powers. And this is not a one series video. Definitely, I'll continue making them because this game is horrifyingly long. It's it's just amazing. And we captured Tver. That's pretty. That's that city. I think it's pretty small, but maybe because of its mobile position, not far away from Saint Pete, or should I call it Petrograd? Well, let's call it Petrograd better. Not far away from the Petrograd, Petrograd. Yes, um, that means that we could continuously hold attacks against the, the Petrograd, and with our forces from um, Russian Finland, as I remember, that's the name of the country from Russian Finland, we could continuously, uh, when we finish the war, yeah, I forgot about this, oh, no, 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 not the right thing, uh, God, I hate this game sometimes, but when we finish the war against these uh, bad guys, we could continue a war against another bad guys, which in the war were neutral, but here they showed like not neutral, okay, we're gonna help um, our Romanian, Romanian allies to, we're gonna hold uh, attacks on this guy, Zhekov, he sounds like a Russian, but Bul Bulgarians are logically, mm, mm, how is slow, S kind of connected to Russia, I don't know Russian history, what do you want from me, but the great part is that we finally winning against this guy, and we're attacking Minsk, capital of Belarus, Belarus, yes, Belarus, not Belarus, and mm, battles next to, I remember, I remember, that's Luxembourg. Mm, 
in the start uh, when I was checking you could go to the video of start and there will be a part where we could see the city of Luxembourg and the country of Luxembourg but there's one problem it's very um, funny but our people have less food than needed that's or a coincidence or just it's horrifyingly um, identical to the real situation in Russia at that time um, it's a dilemma I could uh, get rid of Prune I don't know who she is uh, they already captured the Baltic states these goddamn Jerry's how would any American say but yes we could attack the Baltic states uh, I mean defend the Baltic states but I don't need them they they're not Russia I'm a good person. I don't want to hold them, but I'm pretty sure that the Russia is better than Germany at that time. I don't know. They're both bad at that time, I think so. Both of these countries were not free at that time. But, yes. But there's problems. This beautiful Austria-Hungarian general is a um, problem for me, because my men could not and um, could not defend him, defend against him. But it's very funny. But the maker of this mode is Russian. I've seen him not in real life, definitely. He uploads videos about how to download all this modification, and he was talking at the one moment in Russian, and that amazes me. General Foch was defeated. I think so. I know who the hell that guy is. But the British, as they always do, they do nothing. Just stay there, getting destroyed by... I'm pretty sure London Dorf got hit them from his city. Oh, finally, for this strange person named Frunt is dead. And here, the great assault of St. Petersburg. Well, I'm not pretty... I'm not still assaulting them, I'm just attacking them in a very deformed way of... Sending my troops to the border of... Well, yes, we could attack Joseph Stalin here. Um, I will definitely be sent to the gulags for such things, but okay. Um, oh, no, 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 that's a bad idea. Because if we win the battle without moving as a moving unit, we could take the city back. And why the names are Polish? That, that makes me a little bit strange. Oh, here's uh, London Dorf, as I remember. Yay, this um, guy with a very strange beard. But look at this great empire. They think that they could survive, but they will die of a horrifying death. But which made by a country which likes freedom. Definitely America. Here these guys are attacking Bruce, Bruce, Brussels. I don't know English. Don't I don't know English. Just. That's the main thing. Oh, and how, what a coincidence, a Jew selling things. I'm still amazed that a Russian made this mode, because I'm pretty sure there'll be some kind of old lady selling something. A very old lady, and a very angry old lady. But at this moment, I'm happily saying that Switzerland is not neutral. They, in the start of the... Oh, God damn it, we are starving more and more. This is all a coincidence, or everything is going to go bad for you, my Sovietsky friends. I'm trying to make a Russian accent. It's 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 very hard. Oh no, that's a that's a, that's a that's like also. <laughs> I can't understand. Is it coincidence or this man maybe is a genius? Maybe this man is a genius, but Stalin is dead. <laughs> I feel very, at the same moment, horrified, and um, it, it's kind of funny saying that Stalin is dead, but if I said it twice, if I said it once, maybe I'll not be sent to the gulags, but I said it twice, so definitely, we all know what's gonna happen. <sighs> memories, memories are good, not always. So here, I'm upgrading, oh, I didn't tell you anything about this game. I just came in talking about some stuff and about London Durf, about Stalin. I didn't say how to play the game, that's the main part. Gameplay. So here we see we could upgrade the city, we could have put generals, assigned generals, we could lose our 
our ally. Oh god. We have allies, that's also a main thing. Now I'm playing as a member of the uh, Ant Entente, as I remember the name. Oh, look, the um, Maginot line is destroyed from both sides. Well, a little part of the Maginot is still surviving not far from Leonberg, but still, we all know what's gonna happen. We all know that they're at one moment gonna capitulate. And this is going strangely, unhistorically, but at the same moment, I like it. The communists are dying in Kestrogo. And if we capture their last city, the last city, and if we defeat all the fortresses of any country, not the communists only, uh, then we could finally get a hold of the country. The country will be destroyed, massacred. But this is the last Russian uh, Soviet city. I need to destroy it, massacre all the enemies. And here's the problem. Um, the comrade Lenin has low health. I, I, don't, I don't want to make this accent anymore. I can't make a Russian accent. It's, it's uh, English Russian. Could you say that? A English Russian accent? I think so you could say a Russian English accent, but not the English Russian accent. What? How is it possible uh, to make a Russian uh, English? God damn it. I'm, I'm breaking my myself, my own brain. Oh, here's Mehmet. And we are killing him. Like it happened in the real world. Yes, he world. World. I said it, something. I think so. I'm turning into a Russian person. Okay, why I'm talking about so much about Russia? Let's talk about the other world, the better world, the much better places in the world, good places. And there's one part of this game which amazed me a lot. It was at the same moment funny, comical, and it was a very strange moment. Let me defeat the force of Petrograd. This you may not know who this is. But this is Lawrence of Arabia in Egypt, in British... What the hell is he doing there? In British Egypt. Why? I... Jerusalem, it must be here somewhere. And there's Sinai somewhere down there. And Suez is somewhere here. Yeah, they know so much things. Mm -hmm. Oh, the Germans are getting massacred like they always do. Um, yes, I didn't see anything. No one will find me and destroy me. Because saying some bad things and oh, they captured Brussels. They did something. The Americans. Wait, what? Is the Confederacy? What? Wait, is the Confederacy Confederacy still intact? Why is there only like thirteen? The thirteen colonies. Oh, we lost this. No one cares about them. No, we don't need. It. Oh, I didn't use the the turn to. How much of the video is going? I don't know. I don't care. But in maybe two minutes we'll stop it because there's problems. That because my my Android device is discharging. That's a possibility. Uh, a starting YouTuber could have a discharging device, and everything will be bad. But in the first theory, we defeated the. Co I'm amazed. Literally, I'm amazed. We defeated the communists. And that's pretty good. We defeated the attacking uh, attacking Germans, yes. Attacking Germans. Uh, we captured Petrograd, St. Pete's back, and now we're advancing into, to take back German territories of uh, the Baltics. I don't know what's Reval. Is it like modern day Tallinn? Because this is... St I remember the map of the world. What the hell? Is Vilnius doing so far? Maybe I'm not right. Maybe this border is like this is uh, Latvia or Lithuania. I don't remember. There, there. And this is then Lithuania or Latvia. And this is Estonia. So yes, that looks kind of like 
Okay, we are losing food. That's a problem. That's very bad. Because if our people are gonna starve like they always do, um, then everything will be pretty bad. But um, <laughs> sometime, give me some time, and the video will end when I will have one percent left. Because I will. But maybe I could do a, a smart thing. It will be uncomfortable for some of you to watch, but I lowered the the stuff and. Now the video will be going a little bit, uh, I mean the, my phone will be discharged.